Hey, thank you all for being me here today. It's so great to see you and hopefully catch up since we survived the selling process of your house in the spring. Yeah. <laughs> so can you tell me a little bit about what you did to your house from the time that you purchased it until we put it on the market? We had it for about five years and did everything from putting a driveway in, tearing up the whole entire yard, planted new grass, did a roof, windows, a lot of drywall work, uh, redid the floors, pretty much everything you could possibly think of. From the ground up. Wow. So. And then what made you decide to sell that house? The, the kids, especially this one. <laughs> it is a great house and we love the house, but it just wasn't enough room to spend the money to add on to a house built in 1949 when we could sell it, especially what you were able to sell it for and put down for the house we want with more room, enough bedrooms for everyone. So it just made sense to sell it. Yeah, our timeline for selling your house got kind of sped up a little bit from where we had originally thought so, we were gonna go. Yes, so if you remember correctly, I was in my kitchen making dinner and I accidentally might have put my feelers out on Facebook to sell our house. <laughs> And in an instant, I had to call you, realize I made a mistake. I should not have posted anything online. Yeah, you, you called me and you're like, what did you do? <laughs> I have people calling me from everywhere wanting your house. You and I stayed up until about midnight, talking on the phone, answering your questions, and then you sent me documents all night long, <laughs> signed those, got it for work the next morning. So a four month process. Got four, four days. Got thrown into four days because of me. <laughs> You know, and the best part, I moved very fast. And you moved and to his speed. I, <laughs> and then when I emailed you and you emailed me back in like three minutes, we already had a game plan for the next couple days when you was coming out. Yep. So I told her, I'm like, well, I finally found somebody that works at my speed. <laughs> I've had practice. I kept up with you when you were 10. Right, right. <laughs> it was awesome that not only have I been able to help you sell your house, but the best thing is, is the connection we have as your fifth grade teacher right. way back when and to me that is very special and i feel like through you my life has definitely kind of come full circle because i love being a teacher and i love being a real estate agent and it was really fun to sit down and really talk you through the process and kind of help you learn navigate through all of the crazy it, it was definitely quite quite the experience <laughs> one would never forget it was fast but it went so it was so smooth it just felt like family was coming in to help us in a situation when we really needed help. And because of the whole process, we were able to, you know, build our dream home. So because of you, now we get our dream, whereas before wasn't going to happen. Thank you. And I'm glad I can be part of that. And I can't wait to come see your house when it's finished. We can't wait for it to be finished. <laughs> Any day. Can't wait for Jace to give me a tour. He's already called his bedroom. Oh, good. <laughs> Thank you all for coming to meet me. And Thank you for being more than just clients. I do consider you family and you'll forever be near and dear to my heart.